Bottom, bottom, bottom. Bottom, what? Oh my god! Somewhere in Japan, there's an abandoned building that is believed to be haunted. About a year ago, two friends had paid a visit to this building. They check out the place and agreed that there's something very unsettling about it. However, the reason for visiting this building isn't just to explore the place, but rather for something else. Ooh, 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 ooh! To smoke fentanyl. That's like the new thing of today. Get out of here, meth. You know, take a step back, cocaine. Everybody in the know knows that it's all about fentanyl now. Have you died today? Well, if you haven't, then you need to try fentanyl. Man, it'll knock whatever health problems that you have right out of you because you won't be breathing no more. That's the cool kids <laughs> stuff. <laughs> Yay, fentanyl! Come on, meth! Sweet, sweet, delicious meth. Show your pussy, bitch! As it turns out, one of the friends had lost the bet to the other. And so, for his punishment, the loser must spend the night inside this building mm -mm. all by himself. No, no. And just to make sure that he doesn't cheat or nope. avoid this punishment, no. a camera is placed inside the room he sleeps in mm -mm. to record him at all times. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. As the bet loser spends the night inside the building, nope. the following is caught on camera. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Nope. I'm not doing it. There's no bet in the world. There's not enough money. There's not enough vagina. There's not enough titty meat. There's not enough, you know what I mean? There's not enough Chick-fil-A. There's not enough Chipotle burrito meat. There's not enough, there's not enough of nothing to be doing this shit. Is a ghost gonna be a female who pulls her breast out? Oh no. Wow, ghost stealing this nigga's shoes. Oh shit. Yeah, Rob, steal. Oh God, ass gaffle, butt, butt gaffling. Oh, my nigga getting up, okay. Oh, what he doing? Okay, he's in doggy style position. Oh my God, and then your shoe moved. And then you just, did you not know your shoe moved or? What was that? Did something yell? Why would anyone stay here, bro? Like, dude, this chalk. Out of nowhere, this person's shoes begin to move on their own. It appears that something was messing around with them. At least they wasn't Jordans. You'd have to shoot the ghost if they were Jordans. Hey, all I know, you niggas better not be touching my J's, cuz. As if that wasn't creepy enough, around the same time the man wakes up, a figure of some sort can be seen walking slowly against the wall before vanishing from sight. Viewers believe that something paranormal was caught. But of course, what do you think? Did something supernatural actually occur? Or is there a possible explanation for what happened that night? For more information on the story, you can check out the full video on the YouTube channel, Fourth Wall. The following photo was submitted by Shockwave74, who writes, This was a photo taken years ago by wife and husband. They moved into a new beautiful home the wife then decided to take a photo of her husband in the living area, but when they saw the photo, they were left terrified and shocked. The following is the picture she took. Oh my God. Y'all got Michael Myers in the background, nigga? What are you doing? This ain't Halloween, bitch. Is it? <laughs> More at 11. If you look close enough, you can make out what appears to be a head in the background of this image. Now, although this might be an actual person, it's unknown if the married couple had any guests over during the time of this photo. But given their reaction upon seeing the figure, it's most likely that whoever, or whatever this is, was uninvited. Not much else is known about the photo, but I'll leave it to you to decide whether a ghost was captured or not. What exactly had the married couple caught in this image? 
If you caught something creepy on camera, over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. That being said, let's get back to the video. Renea, you're going to make me laugh this depression away. What did Renea say? Facebook Those user Dayana Kari works at a bank in Calo, Peru. The bank in question isn't thought to be haunted, but after watching yeah. this video, which was sent to Dayana by a co-worker at the bank, it might just be. The video starts off with said co-worker who's recording a conversation that's being had with another employee when all of a sudden, the convo is interrupted by something. This is what was caught. <laughs> Bottom, bottom, bottom. Bottom what, nigga? Oh my god! No! No, no! 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 Which doesn't make any sense, as there shouldn't have been any customers inside, let alone a child. The employees in the video had been the only ones there. Yet, yeah, it seems that someone, or perhaps something yes, else, damn, was there with chat. them. There has damn, yet to be more information given on this video, but until then, we'll have to base our judgment on the recording itself. As always, what are your thoughts on this? Man, I don't trust none of that shit. Oh, comes from James Fodder, who recently bought a doll from a secondhand store. Apparently, the doll is worth a lot more than what the store was selling it for. Bro, that doll ugly as shit. How does he not know the doll is haunted? This man must not be from Mother Russia, huh? I do not trust it. For this reason, James had bought the doll. However, ever since bringing it home, strange things have been happening. From hearing strange noises at night, to seeing doors open and close on their own, James suspects that the doll might be responsible for the unusual activity in his house. And so, he decides to record the doll in front of a camera inside an empty room. He hopes to capture footage of something that would prove it's haunted. Initially, nothing odd is captured in the first few days of recording, but then one night, something very strange happens. Now the camera that he uses is programmed to move wherever it picks up movement. So, if something moves, it will point to that object. We could see it doing that in this footage. But strangely, the camera pans around the room as though it's picking up movement from somewhere. This is what was captured. I do not trust Dal, huh? I do not... Sergei does not trust... Very... Does not trust many things. This doll being one of them. This looks like if Cabbage Patch had sex with Chucky. And then they have illegitimate child because back then condoms are for quitters. Huh? I don't like this shit, man. Please don't let nothing happen. Can we not have nothing happen, please? Please? We just gonna have a regular ghost video. Nothing haunted gonna happen. What's is something in the bathroom? Nigga, hey, better not be no face. You better not turn around and let there be a face. Prepare! Nothing on the window! What's going on? What the fuck is going on? Could it be that the camera is detecting an unseen presence? Or is it just not functioning properly? Although it's likely that there's a problem with the camera, something really creepy happens two nights later inside the room, which has made him think that the camera was actually picking up something. James is away from home when the following happens. He writes, Just wow. I've been leaving the closets open in case anyone thinks I'm hiding inside. I don't even know what to say. This is what was captured. I don't like this shit. I don't like none of this shit, nigga. The fuck? Quit playing. Quit playing. Hold on now. Bitch, be cool. Just bitch, be cool. Nah, just be cool. Be cool, bitch. Don't you do this. Ah! Ah! Was that a huge nutsack? Was that a small, small scroll? Somebody's testiculars went running across the stream. Out of James's bathroom comes out what appears to be a dark, shapeless figure. It seems to dart across the floor before disappearing from sight. James- Rats! He's got rats! 
Kill it! It's got rats, my nigga! ...believes that this may have been the apparition that was being picked up earlier by the camera. He also thinks that this mysterious figure might be attached to the doll. Ever since then, he's been filming more at night. Little does he know that he would eventually capture something more terrifying than this. James is sleeping in his room upstairs when the following happens. That's a big ass roach if that's a roach. Even I couldn't fight that shit, nigga. Can you imagine if a roach that big flapped its wings? What do you do? What do you do if a roach that big flap? Oh, 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 no, 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 please. <laughs> I don't want this. I don't deserve any of this. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Nope! All of a sudden, the doll moves on its own. It appears to move for just a few seconds before abruptly stopping. Feeling very unsettled, James posts the footage online to see if anyone could explain this video. It's not sure if he'll continue to hold on to this doll, given what occurred, but it might be best if he keeps it locked up inside this room, as an occurrence like this definitely warrants it. As always, what are your thoughts on this? Had something paranormal occurred? Or had something else happened? Yep. Little Annabelle, uh, little the following Annabelle video shows a priest a who's about to give a sermon when something really creepy happens. Although not much info is given on the video, the title of the clip says it all, which reads, A priest is about to give a speech, but immediately hears screams. The clip is pretty unsettling to say the least. This is what was captured. El Señor esté con ustedes y con tu espíritu. Lectura del Santo Evangelio según San Juan. The priest was immediately caught off guard upon hearing the mysterious screams. According to those who attended the ceremony, the priest had to end the mass immediately after this. No one knows why the mass had to end so soon, but there is no denying that the screams had something to do with this. Whether paranormal or not, the sudden occurrence of this mysterious scream is unnerving on its own, but with everyone else's reaction to the cry, it makes it even more frightening. This recording was taken about four months ago, and still, no one knows where the cries had come from. As with most videos, this one remains a mystery. Kids did not look like I want to be there. This next video comes from Jack Steffens, who spent the night at a hotel that is considered to be the most haunted hotel in the U.S. The hotel in question is known as the Biltmore Hotel, which is located over in Providence, Rhode Island, and its history is lingered with paranormal activity. From seeing objects move on their own, to hearing laughter from parties that can't be found, former guests of the hotel have encountered things that they couldn't explain. And just like those who've stayed here before, Jack Steffens encounters something beyond explanation. Late one evening, Jack is lying in bed inside his hotel room, when all of a sudden, the bathroom door inside the room shuts itself forcefully. A few minutes pass, and the door opens all on its own, but then closes again immediately. Terrified by this incident, Jack proceeds to grab his camera and records the following. This is what he captured. All right, you can see that the bathroom is down there at the end of the hallway. The bathroom door is the one that has been slamming itself by apparently unseen forces. I'm gonna stand here for a couple minutes. If it happens again, then I'm gonna catch it on video. 
it doesn't happen again, then I'm going to set my camera down and try to just let it sit there and wait and catch it when it happens. I don't like this shit. Anything can come out of that bathroom. Just did it again. I cannot believe I got that on video. I cannot believe I got that. There is nobody in this room except for me. Which means you need to get the hell out of there, nigga. Run, ho! That is the freakiest thing ever. There's nobody back here. I. The door suddenly closes on its own, as though someone had slammed it hard. Based on this recording, we can tell that Jack was left baffled. Now, if Jack hadn't recorded the inside of this bathroom, the authenticity of this video might have been called into question. It could have been that someone was hiding inside and waiting to close the door at the right time. However, as Jack shows us, no one is inside the bathroom. Given the history of this hotel, it seems that something unexplainable was caught on camera. But of course, I'll pass the judgment over to you. Did something paranormal occur in Jack's room? The well, power of Christ does save to get the hell out of there. Or is there a possible explanation for what Jack had encountered? If you caught something creepy on camera or scary videos for for Lauren Combs and her dog Luna live in a house located in the middle of nowhere. Nothing but woods surround her home and very few people come and visit as she lives in a secluded area far from everyone else. Although Lauren lives in complete isolation, something very strange happened not too long ago that's made her wonder if she's actually alone. One night, while walking her dog through the woods, her dog Luna begins to act strange. The following is the video she took. Luna. I think I ain't playing. Luna. Uh oh. What the fuck is that? Is that Slender Man, nigga? What? I was like, bitch, run! Bitch, let's get out of here! Run, bitch! Go home. Luna, go home. And leave me? No, 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 no. Luna, come on. Stop. Bitch, you need to get a gun. It seems that her dog Luna is sensing someone or something nearby. Yet, there appears to be nothing suspicious in sight. Now, like with most dogs, it could be that Luna had seen a squirrel or some small rodent, thus causing her to react this way. However, this wouldn't be the only time Luna acts strange, as on a different night, Lauren records the following behavior from Luna. What? What is wrong with you? Luna. What is wrong? What? What? You big head, what? What? Based on these two videos, viewers believe that Luna is sensing something which cannot be seen. Whatever it might be, viewers think that Luna is trying to protect her owner from this unknown presence. Ever since then, she's been acting more strange. But then one day, the strangest thing happened. As Lauren is resting at home, the following is caught on camera.
Oh hell no. What the fuck? Luna, come on. It goes without saying, but Lauren was shaken up by this incident. If no one had been at the front door, then how was the doorbell going off on its own? It's because of this incident that Lauren thinks her house is haunted. Although some think that this might have been caused by an electrical problem, thus causing the constant ringing, others believe that something else is going on. One incident in particular, though, has led them to believe that the house might actually be haunted. Luckily, Lauren was able to capture this odd occurrence on her security camera. Take a look. Out of nowhere, the books on the shelf fall to the ground as though they were pushed off forcefully. Like most viewers, Lauren can't think of anything to explain this. No. But as always, what do you think? Run, bitch. Could it be that Lauren is actually experiencing paranormal activity? Or is there something else going on? Feel free to share what you think down below. I think I said poltergeist. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to comment, like, and don't subscribe. This is your boy Blasphemous HD. Twisms.